and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be bringing you guys along shopping with me for fall decor and we'll be going to Home Goods, Target, and TJ Maxx. So let's grab your iced coffee and let's get started. So we're gonna start off at Home Goods first. Your girl had to stop by her Starbucks and get an iced pumpkin spice latte. It was delicious. One of my favorite ones. I'm not a big fan of hot coffee, so I had to get the iced version and it's really delicious. Um, but right here, me and Alex are just going through the Halloween section. It's what you see right when you get in, so that's where we went to first. Um, there wasn't really a lot right here. I really like these garland. They were $12.99 and I was thinking these would be really pretty for um, the fireplace, but I figured Michael's might have something a little bit different. They were actually really short and I would need two of them, but there weren't two of the orange ones. But we're just going through and just looking at all the Halloween decorations that they have in the store. So next we went to the kitchen section of home goods and this is just like their baking section if you bake i would recommend going to walmart because they have a bigger baking selection there for the fall and halloween um, but i found this really cute kitchen towel um, i really really love it and i actually found two other kitchen towels and i had to get all three of them just because i couldn't figure out which one i wanted and just figured i'd alternate them um, throughout the season as i wash them and stuff so I'm just going through and showing you guys what they had. I found these napkins for $8. I believe they were a set of six or eight. Um, they're cute. I always pick them up, but I decided to um, change kind of like the theme of the dining room that I wanted to do. But this is all, um, this is the aprons that they had there. I was trying to find an apron that went with all the towels that I got. So I was able to find one, but here are all the other ones that they had. And then these thyme and sage kitchen towels are my absolutely favorite. They're thick and soft, and I really, really love this brand. And I think you can only get them at Home Goods and TJ Maxx. You might be able to find them somewhere else, but I, that's normally where I get those from. And they're my favorite, so definitely check them out. I believe you get a set of four for maybe $8, maybe a little bit less. But here are all the Halloween decorations that they had. There wasn't really many, but I was just looking to see if there was anything that caught my eye, but I didn't want to get any more kitchen towels because I already had three for the fall. Lastly, we stopped by the blanket section and the pillow section. Uh, me and Alex just went through and tried to find a blanket that we wanted for the living room. We both get our own little blankets so that we're not fighting over who gets the cover. So we went through and picked out our own. There wasn't really a lot, but the ones that were there were actually really, really cute. So next we stopped by Target and we went to the threshold section, which there really wasn't a lot. Um, we did find this the cute little plant, but it was $25 and I just, I don't know, I felt like I could find that maybe somewhere a little bit cheaper. So I just decided I wouldn't get anything from this section. My goal was to try and find a lot of pieces from this bullseye playground section, but they really didn't have a lot there. It just seemed very picked over or if they haven't received all of their shipment yet, but I was able to find a couple pieces. Um, there, there was this cute frame, which I actually picked up. It's super cute. There was a gold one, but I liked the black one better. And they just had some stickers, some cute little decals, um, 
so I was just going through them just trying to see that one was really cute it said home you could just do kind of like your DIYs but again there wasn't really a lot there the last store we'll be going to is TJ Maxx. Um, I, I don't know why, but I always catch myself going through the clearance section, but I was able to find something there. And then I was just going through and just seeing what they had. I was looking for some baskets, but the majority of their stuff was kitchen towels. Um, I was just showing you all, all the ones that they had. I wanted to pick some up there too, but I knew I couldn't do it anymore just because I already picked up three at Home Goods. but I just figured I'd show you guys just kind of what they had again there's that thyme and sage brand um definitely check them out again home goods and tj maxx has those towels um they're my favorite but i'm just going through and just kind of showing you like their prices 5.99 for these two towels was actually a really good deal but i'm just going through and showing you guys what they had So next we went to the pillow section and I thought this pillow was super, super cute. Um, Alex really loved that pillow, so we actually got that one, but I'm just showing you guys all the different pillows that they had. They were super cute, had really, really nice detailings to them. Um, they ranged from anywhere from $16.99 to maybe $25.99. It just depends like how big of a pillow you wanted, but I picked the first one that I showed you guys. That one was $16.99. So as far as Halloween decorations, I will say TJ Maxx really didn't have a lot like Home Goods did, but um, I just figured I'd show you guys just a little bit of, that they had in store. So I went through their candle section and they had so many cute candles. I really love that aesthetic of the wood topping. I thought that was super, super cute. Um, they had a lot of different um, scents, uh, some big and some small. I believe they were ranging anywhere from $3.99 up to like $15. It just depended on how big you wanted because I believe they had bigger ones than those. But I really loved the way those candles look with the wood tops. They had so many there. So as I was going through the store at TJ Maxx, I noticed that they really didn't have a lot like they did at Home Goods, and I thought Home Goods didn't have that much. So they had very very little here. Like this is all of the blankets that they had at TJ Maxx. So I did find this cute one, and I almost got it, but Alex picked out his own. So um, and he really liked the other one, but I'm just going through and kind of showing you the little bit that they had there. So I found these cute signs at TJ Maxx and they're super cute. I really loved all of them. I wish I could take all of them home, but I did find a couple of them there. Uh, I think I only picked up one, but I just went through and kind of just showed you guys what they had. They were starting off at like maybe $2.99 and I think the most expensive one was like maybe $7.99, so not too bad.
So I found these cute pumpkins at TJ Maxx, but they were really expensive. Like these little ones were $5.99 and at Target they were only a dollar. So I didn't pick up any pumpkins there and just figured I'd try another Target instead. Guys could see there wasn't really a lot of fall decor at the stores that we would, went to. Um, there was more Halloween stuff and I was looking more for fall decor, but I did find a couple nice pieces and I just wanted to do a little haul and show you guys what I got. Um, I did find a lot of um, cute like accessories at Home Goods, so I just thought I'd show you guys here on this video as well. So we'll go ahead and just kind of do the same order that I went to Home Goods, Target, and TJ Maxx. So let's go ahead and start that haul. The first thing me and Alex picked up was this glass set. It is a set of 16 glasses and it was only $12.99 and they're really nice. Um, they're just like these little simple cups and they come with the 16 ounce and the 8 ounces as well. This one was a really really good find especially for it to be $12.99. I'm pretty happy with what we got. So we'll kind of just go in order of like kitchen and stuff like that. So the next thing that I got, I actually got three of them which I really don't know why I got Oh no, it fell. Um, I don't know why I got three sets of towels, but they were all cute and I just couldn't decide which one. But I have this one, it's the Fall Sweet Fall. Um, it is like a burgundy color and that one's the only one that had like a, like just some writings. The rest were like checkered and striped. This one, I'm pretty sure you guys saw this one in the video it says harvest blessings it's just really pretty it's a set of two um this one was $6.99 and the first one was $7.99 so that, they're really really cute and then i got this one pumpkin spice and everything nice this one was a set of two and it was $6.99 um i really like it the other side says pumpkin spice i also got this which i'm pretty sure you guys saw this in the video as well it is an apron um i believe this one yeah this one was $9.99 and i thought it was really pretty it went with any of the towels that i picked up so orange the burgundy there's not really a lot of burgundy but it would still kind of go and then it had blues with this one so i just thought this one just went um for the fall and it could go for halloween as well next so. thing that i got for the kitchen was these um chip holders um they were really really pretty they were a pin 10 piece for 4.99 and then we got this as well we've been having a hard time trying to find a utensil holders for like our forks and knives um because the counter that we have them in is like an odd shape so this one is actually too small but the other ones that we keep finding are too big so we just decided that we'll just keep this one um and eventually we'll find one that'll work. But this one was only $4.99, so I really, really like this one. Alex actually got these. They're shot glass and a set of six. Um, these were $5.99, and they're just simple. These are what they look like. They're just some like generic shot glass. The thing that I got was this um, mat, just for where the cats have their food. Um, it was $2.99, and it just has like a little paw print on there, and I just wanted something to wear. Um, if they did spill some food or water, it wouldn't just, you know, mess up the wood. So I found this. Um, again, it was $2.99. So we actually got two blankets. So I don't know if you guys saw this one in the video, um, but this one's actually my blanket. It is just a cream gray, um, and it was $14.99. It's really, really soft. I don't know the size. It's an oversized 50 inch by 70 inch. Super pretty. Um, it kind of like went with the like my couches and stuff. So that's one of the reasons why I got it. And then Alex picked out this one. He just loved like how it looked. So this is the one that it's gonna be for him. So we just have our own um, blankets because sometimes like we fight over blankets. Um, but I really recommend trying to purchase your um, blankets at either TJ Maxx or Home Goods just because they actually give you the hanger. And I thought this was really really neat because once we're done with these, we can actually put them in the guest. Um, closet and just hang them up. So the next two things that we got 
Um, we were not expecting to find this at Home Goods. Um, we just happened to stumble upon them. Um, and I'm kind of glad that we did because it kind it'll go with the table that I ordered from Amazon, which I'll put um, the picture up right here. But we have we got this. This is this super super cute. It says happiness is homemade. I put this in the entryway just to kind of give it you know something on that plain wall. And then the next thing I got, I am super excited about because everywhere that I've looked to purchase one, it was like 100 to $150. I got was this 30 inch um, mirror to go in the entryway as well. Sorry if you can like see everything over there. But um, it's really, really nice. It's black. It's actually this thick border. Um, and it was only $49.99. And it, I really, really like it. It's really big. Um, kind of show you guys. And um, it would be perfect in the entryway. Again, it'll go perfect with that table that I ordered from Amazon. So I'm super excited that we found this. It was something that I've been looking for. Again, everywhere that I went, it would be like $100 to $150. Um, and I found one at Ikea, but every time I try and get it, it would be sold out. And right now, it's not expected to be back in stock until I think the end of October, closer to November. So I found this, it was the same price as the one as Ikea, and I actually feel like it's a little better quality, so we had to pick it up. So that was everything that I got at Home Goods. We're gonna go ahead and start with the Target haul next. So like I mentioned before, um, the, all the stores that I went to did not have um, a really good selection, but Target was worse. Like there was nothing at Target, you know, the Bulldogs playground, there was nothing there. I had to go again later, um, like the next day and they actually started getting some stuff. So I don't know if they just were being picked over or if Target was received, or at least my Target was receiving everything super late because they didn't even have any of the Halloween stuff. And all my friends were saying, go to Target, but I'm assuming their Target already have their stuff stocked or out, but mine did not. So I'll just show you the little things that I got. So the first thing I got was this Welcome Autumn. Again, I thought this would look perfect with the table that I'm ordering from Amazon, especially with like the black X or the black wording would go really great with the black mirror. So I'm just gonna put this on that table as well or like on the floor leaning against the table when you enter. So I thought this was really, really cute and this one was $5. The next thing that I got from the playground section were these two little pumpkins. I was looking for some orange ones, but they didn't have any. These were both a dollar a piece. Um, they're super, super pretty. They were white with gold accents, and this one was a green with a gold accent as well. Um, again, my Target really didn't have a lot of stuff, so hopefully um, when I go again, they will have gotten all their stuff out. What I got were these little stickers. They were also a dollar. What I got was this cute little frame. Um, it was $3, um, and it actually says thankful on the bottom, if you can see that. Um, it's super, super pretty. Again, this is for the entryway as well. Pretty much it that I got for fall decorations at Target. Like I said, there really wasn't a lot. So the last store I went to was TJ Maxx, and I really didn't get a lot from them either. It just really wasn't what I was looking for. Again, I really wanted to get a lot of my key pieces from the Target bull, um, Bullseye Playground, but they just didn't have any. So hopefully the next time I go back, they will have a couple more items in stock. Um, but I wanted to show you guys the rug that I got. I, again, if you saw my last video, I mentioned this one. Um, but this is the mat that I got from TJ Maxx. It's the welcome and it has two little pumpkins. And I got this one for $9.99, um, which was really, really good. It's a really big rug for the front entrance. The thing that I got TJ Maxx was this little pillow. It is so cute. Alex actually picked this one out. I really like it. It has some really good, nice detailing to it. And it was only $16.99. Next thing that I got was this little frame right here or sign. Um, it just says family gather here. Um, it was only $5.99. It has orange and black writing. So it just kind of pulls from the black and the oranges that I want to do in the um, living room. Again, it was only $5.99. It's super pretty. They did have a lot of different ones, but I still have some from last year. So I wanted to look at those before I purchased them. The last thing that I got was this cute little cup from TJ Maxx. It's nothing to do with autumn, but I just saw it when I walked by and I just thought it was super, super cute. It says, I don't know if you can see it, Rob. 
rise up with like little wings and it was only a dollar. Um, they had a couple cute mugs in the clearance section, um, but this one just kind of stood out to me. So that's all that I got from those stores there. As you can see, I really didn't get a lot of fall decorations like I had hoped. Hopefully I will be able to go to different stores later on this week just to see if they have any fall decorations. But make sure to give me a thumbs up if you like this video and leave me a comment down below what video you'd like to see next or just let me know of any stores that you think of that will have fall decorations and I'll do another video of a come shopping with me. But let me know in the comments down below and thanks so much for watching guys. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!